Hi, welcome to Laura's Fendora. Today I'm going to show you how to make this 4th of July paper mache star. So first off, I created a star. I drew out a star on cardboard. The size that I want, cut that up and then traced it again on another piece of cardboard and cut that out so I have two exact same sized star cardboard pieces. Then I cut out a paper towel roll into five pieces and I placed them in each uh, point of the star and kind of sandwiched them together between the two star cardboard pieces. Then I took some tape and taped all the edges together. This just helps stabilize it while you're paper macheing around it. Then using a cup of glue, Elmer's glue, and a cup of water, mix that together and started paper macheing my star with strips of newspaper. After I let that dry overnight, I kind of sanded it down and made sure all the edges were good. If I needed to add an extra layer of paper mache, you can, but at this point I, I not only going to use it for a week or so and then put it down. So I only use one layer of paper mache. So after it dried, <clears throat> I then drew out a star in the middle where I was going to paint with red and then around that I painted, I painted the edge blue and then after those two, after those two dried I painted in between them with white. Then I let that set aside for a couple minutes, let it dry, and then I splattered it with all the other colors to make it kind of rustic look. And voila, it is done. I poked a couple holes in the back so I could hang it on some hanger uh, for the door. And that's how I made my paper mache 4th of July star. And it's pretty sweet. I hope this gives you a um, fun idea for decorating your home for this 4th of July. And happy 4th of July! And uh, subscribe below if you want more crafts or more music. And thanks for watching. Please subscribe.